we're at the launch site now. It's a bit rain and uh, pretty low clouds, but uh, we're gonna set everything up and then wait for, uh, for it to clear up. It's looking better in the after launch. And that's when we're gonna do the first attempt to launch. So we've loaded the, uh, the rocket into the launch tower. Uh, we're now making some uh, final setups. We're uh, making the release mechanism and uh, so the flight computer will start recording. In a second we'll start uh, fueling and um, we'll launch in 10 15 minutes. Are you excited? Oh, no kidding. It's, uh, it's been a long time in preparation and now it's finally here. It's, uh, it's hard to uh, well, keep calm and uh, do things methodically. I'm so excited, I wanted to get going and uh, but, uh, things are going well. We're a little bit worried about the uh, clouds pulling in now, and, uh, but uh, it should be fine. Three, two, eight, four. So yesterday the fire was successful. Uh, it went straight up into the clouds, but unfortunately we didn't see where it landed and the beacon lost its signal. So today we searched the area uh, where it most likely landed with a, a ballistic uh, landing. Uh, and then we searched the area where it was most likely to land with a parachute deployed and with the wind that was yesterday. Uh, unfortunately, we didn't find it, but uh, uh, our hopes are up that we can retrieve it uh, maybe sometime next year when the snow is gone. Yeah, I'm very, very happy with this result and I, I think it's a big su success. Uh, we accomplished what we wanted and we launched the rocket. Uh, so next time we're gonna, gonna learn from this and improve and uh, hopefully for the next rocket we go even higher and we will be able to recover it.